car with the girls. Um, it's Saturday. We're on our way right now to a birthday party for one of River's friends. She's been talking about it since yesterday. So I will film some of that. It's at a bounce place. So I gave Reed peanut butter for the first time this morning, which you saw. I mixed it into oatmeal. So that was also her first time having that. And then I mashed some banana in it. She loved it. So that was good. Now I know I can give that to her. I want to start giving her more things to eat and making her solid food more of like a routine. So that was a good start. I curled my hair this morning. So that's good. That'll last for a few days. Not it. So we will see you in a little while when we get to the party. We just got to the bounce place. River is sleeping. There she is. And I'm giving Reed a bottle. I think she's getting tired. So we're a little bit early. I did that so I could feed Reed or change somebody's diaper if that needed to be done before we went in. So I'm probably going to take Reed out of her car seat and just sit her in the stroller. River is going to walk, of course. So hopefully this will go well and I can manage everybody. Um, I know River is going to need my help while she's playing and then I'll have Reed too. I brought the wrap just in case. So we are going to go in in about five or ten minutes and then I'll show you some clips of River playing. <laughs> River didn't want to go on anything and then I let her have two juice boxes and then that livened her up and she was like playing and running around and 
having so much fun. She went on a lot of the bounce houses. Um, they ate pizza, they had cake. She got a goodie bag. She had so much fun. That was her first birthday party that she ever went to, like at an actual place. So we're just heading home now and I'll show you what we do for the rest of the night. What is that river? Um, pickled broccoli. Look. Okay, so our Misfit Market box came today, ha. and we wanted Whoa. to show you what we Look. got. River's showing you a pear. We have a few different pears. We have a bunch of apples, clementines, peppers, ginger, ha. some fresh rosemary, ha. chicken broth. These are sweet potato dog treats and mom look those are called radishes radishes say that we got radishes we got radishes we have two kinds of applesauce pouches for river that's another apple we have radishes grape tomatoes cucumber zucchini dried pineapple potatoes and then purple broccolini doesn't look very good but that's what that is and then we have a bunch of limes and that's everything we got in the box this week right river right and we love baba so it's about 10 o'clock now the kids are sleeping river went to sleep really fast because she had such a busy day. She had so much sugar at the party and after the party. I don't think she's ever had that much, like maybe on Halloween and then tonight. So she had like a bunch of juice boxes at the party, which she's she never ever gets juice. She only has milk and water. And they were like no sugar added, like healthy juice boxes. So they didn't even taste good. I tasted them. I thought they were really gross. She had like a bunch of those. And then um, she had cake. And then they gave them goodie bags that were filled with candy. And she had like Starburst in the car. Then we got home and she was obsessed. Like we could not keep it away from her. So she had nerds and I think that might be it. I don't know, but she had a lot of sugar. And then even before we went to the party, she had like two packs of fruit snacks. So it was really bad. So I'm like cracking down now on sugar for a while. Um, I'm working on an online Walmart order. I'm going to hopefully pick that up tomorrow. I've been working on it for the past couple days. I'm going to try to finish that up tomorrow because we don't have anything here for dinner. And the last thing I want to do is have to go food shopping in the store. I'm trying to stay away from doing that. The dishwasher is running right now. It has the bottles in it. So I have to get Reed's bottles ready once that's finished. Right now, Eric and I are about to go upstairs and do this video game with Born that we play on the Wii U. We will see you tomorrow. That's it. Good night.
sitting outside of Target waiting for Born. He had a Starbucks gift card and they have one in this Target so he ran in there to get that. We just finished um, getting our Walmart pickup so we have all the food in the trunk right now. We forgot to get fries that we needed to go with burgers that the guys are going to have probably tonight so he's going to grab those also while he's in Target. Reed is sleeping in the back right now. I'm hoping she'll stay asleep. She does really well in the car most of the time, but if it's sitting still for too long, she's not happy and sometimes she'll even wake up just because the car isn't moving. Um, but she was really tired. She didn't have a morning nap at all, so she is sleeping. River decided to stay home with Eric. Um, they were painting rocks when we left. So today is just going to be a day at home once we get back from getting the food. I'll show you what we got. And um, I just have like laundry to put away. I'm planning to clean out the refrigerator a little. And we'll just show you like what we eat. And that's going to be it really. We might watch a movie upstairs with River. Today we try to make Sunday like family day and just cook something and spend the day at home. I have to have at least one day during the weekend where I'm not out doing things or I don't feel like I got a break and I also feel like I can't catch up at all with cleaning if I am out like the whole weekend. So it's going to be really warm this week, like in the 60s, so I'm really excited. I'm going to start getting the girls outside like every day if I can and going to the playground and stuff like that and just for walks and things. Yeah, so that's about it for now. It's not going to be a very exciting day, but I'll just show you like what we do at home for our family Sunday. So we just got home from getting the stuff from Walmart. Born unloaded everything for me, so that was really cool. Um, River was so excited to see me. She did a beautiful painting for me. Do you want to show your painting? Bring it over here. So before I take all the food out and show you, uh, here's River's painting that she made for me. It's beautiful. We're going to hang that on the refrigerator. Okay, so like I was saying before, I take all the stuff out to show you. I'm Ranger going bands, to. Ranger bands, Ranger bands. She's showing you her new hair ties that we got in the Walmart order. She's calling them. She's trying to say rubber bands, but she's saying Roger bands. So Ranger I. Bands. Okay, quiet, honey. So I'm going to just clean up the refrigerator a little bit and take anything out, like old leftovers and stuff like that, and make room. Then I'll show you what we got, and then I'll put, get all of that put away. Right? I was gone. Yeah. And you I'm showing them my um, my uh, milk. Oh, good. Here's my oh, sorry. Yes. 
sleep. Um, oil. And here's my painting. I made. Here's my painting. I made. And here's my 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 my. And here's my butterfly feet. And here's. The guy came and painted. Is the paint dry? And then the strawberries and the sauce and these and these. Are you going to get dressed now, River? Yeah, for the video! River just passed out while she was drinking her water. She does this a lot on the weekends. I just laid everything out on the counter that I got from Walmart. It wasn't easy to fit everything in this little space. We got a lot of stuff. Um, River really wanted to film this with me, but she passed out on the bed when she was drinking her water. So I got chicken broth because I'm making lemon orzo soup this week. And then I also have the lemons, Parmesan cheese, is for that too and the orzo um i already have the rest of the stuff i need for it i got river this ocean adventure pasta i think she'll love that i got her two unsweetened almond milks butter i got these for river they're total garbage i shouldn't have but she's never had them before and i just sometimes like to get her sweet, like more Fun, interesting snacks to change it up a little. I got her this yogurt, banana strawberry. She was excited for that. I got the guys pork roll and then Bourne asked for ham to make sandwiches. And then I got River for cinnamon raisin bread. She loves having that for breakfast. And then sometimes I also use it to make peanut butter and jelly for work. The buns are for burgers that the guys are making, either tonight or tomorrow. And then Eric wanted rye bread, so he could use this to make a patty melt or grilled cheese, and he just eats it with butter, like toasted with butter sometimes. I got this beef for their burgers, and then this chicken is going to be for a Thai um, dinner that Eric's going to make this week mozzarella cheese to make English muffin pizzas because we got a huge thing of those from Costco and I also can use it to make pizza wraps that sounded good I got this bread for River and for Reed because now I'm starting to feed her more and more stuff and I used to give River this bread like toasted with peanut butter and stuff like that so I got that so she could have some healthy bread, lettuce for the burgers, and then also for the pork roll sandwiches. Parmigiana showed you just some pasta because we just really don't have a lot. I got cream of chicken again to make that same soup for River and me. And I got River these new hair ties. She showed you that earlier when I was cleaning the refrigerator. She was super excited for those. I had a package of like 500 or something and we've actually gone through it already. I got them though probably when she was like a year and a half old so they lasted a really long time. I got River these kids flossers because I have to start flossing her teeth 
regularly now and she just thought that they would be fun. Um, I got this dish soap. This is my favorite dish soap. It's like the only natural dish soap that I have found that actually works really well and gets sudsy. Big thing of paper plates. Um, noodles are to go with the cream of chicken soup. I got the guys this pizza, which they already ate. And then I got this one for myself and River. I got this little package of diapers because I was almost out. And literally the only diapers I like are the Costco brand diapers, but it's not always easy for me to get there to get them. So I got these cheap ones just to hold me over for like two days. And then on Tuesday after River's class, at the Y, I'm gonna run over and get a big thing of diapers for them. I've been putting both girls in size six, that's River size. She only wears diapers at night or if we go out in public because I can't handle using um, a public bathroom with them. So I put her in a diaper. I have to get like a travel potty to use in the car for her because I will never ever take them into a public bathroom. I, my OCD cannot handle it. So I just got those to hold us over. And then I got this huge box of snacks. Again, it's something I should not have gotten, but it just sounded so good. And it's convenient to have things like this to just throw in our bag for work for me to snack on or like just you know a little bit for river to have with her lunch or something and then i got two dozen eggs for us to eat and then um i just got these cheap white eggs to use for dyeing our easter eggs which we're gonna hopefully get to today i got this bleach to use in my laundry some toothpaste, body wash, and hair conditioner. And that is everything that we got. Hopefully it's gonna last the whole week. And I'll show you some of the meals that we make out of this. I, I ate this. River had her yogurt. Did you like your yogurt? Yeah. Yeah. Here's Reed. She's playing with a toy pepper. Toy pepper. And she's been snacking on the Dave's Killer bread. She really likes it. River's been eating it too. River's been snacking all day. She went way too far on the box of like chips and Doritos and stuff. I definitely need to hide that. Um, so it's about 4.15 now. I'm gonna give them a bath in probably like a half hour. I don't like to do bath time right before bed because it's too exhausting. There's already so much to do to get them to bed on time. So I like to do bath time earlier in the night. So we're gonna do that and get that out of the way. The playroom is a huge mess as you can see. So I'm gonna. And we've been, been playing stuck. Yeah, River's been playing a game where she gets stuck, um, and then we use like the trucks and her toy boats and stuff to get it out to get her out. Um, Reed's been practicing her sitting. She's working on learning to sit up all on her own. Right? <laughs> Um, so I'm going to also make River's dinner, like right after her bath, she'll have dinner. I think I'm going to give her, yeah, I'm going to give her, um, some eggs and she's showing you all of her toys. This is her register. For River's dinner, I'm going to boil eggs. I might give her one of those and then I'm thinking of making her that sea creature pasta and just like some peppers and fruit on the side we didn't dye the eggs yet we didn't watch the movie yet so hopefully we can get to all of that stuff still before bed and then i have to do all of the packing and prepping for um work tomorrow and that is it for now so we're just gonna keep playing a little bit longer and then i'm gonna wash the bath I always clean it before they take a bath i have to like every single time they take a bath i have to 
spray it and completely wipe it down first. So I'll do that in a little while and that's about it for now. about five o'clock. River is here having a little milk break and then Reed is in my arms. She needs a nap so she's gonna probably fall asleep soon. I just cleaned the bath so it's ready for them whenever they are ready and I just wanted to show you. I just, River I'm says ready. she's ready. I just wanted to show you I ordered these two dresses for Reed. They just came in the mail and I got them because River has the same ones in her size. I got hers last year. They run really big. They're from Amazon. What? So they still fit her. Reed's also look pretty big, <laughs> but I can't really tell usually until it's actually <laughs> on them. Um, so that's gonna what? be really cute for the summer. What? I need to match them in. What? Yeah, I see you. Okay, here's um, Reed is here. She's hungry. She's waiting for her dinner. River wants her dinner too. Reed's having some bananas with peanut butter. This is River's dinner. I made a homemade mac and cheese. And then she has radishes, half an egg, and strawberries. She's ready to eat. And I'm also working on her lunch for work tomorrow so I can get a head start with that. Let's see if Reed likes her food. Is that good? She likes it, River. How's your dinner? Good. So both girls are sleeping now. They're in the bed. I just got out of the bed, which was not an easy thing to do. I lay in the bed with them while they fall asleep. We co-sleep, so um, I stay in the bed with them until they're both sleeping. It can be really hard to get out of the bed at that point. I always just want to stay in bed and go to sleep. It makes me really tired and it's all warm and cozy. Um, so the last thing I wanted to do is get up and then have to like do all my packing and nighttime prep stuff. But once I get moving again, it's not so bad. When I got the strawberries and radishes ready for dinner, and the egg too actually, when I got all of that ready for her dinner, I just did extra and threw it in the lunchbox. And I'm just giving her the leftover mac and cheese that I made tonight. So pretty much she's having like exactly what she had for dinner tomorrow in her lunchbox. Um, and then I have a bag that I put snacks in also, so I'll just put some snacks in there. I think I'm going to just cut up a piece of her cinnamon raisin bread and put that in there too because she doesn't really eat breakfast before we go. It's just too early. She doesn't have an appetite yet. Sometimes she'll eat a bar or an applesauce or um, some cereal from her snack cup in the car on the way to work but then once we're at work she always wants you know like something to eat. So we did not get to the egg dyeing. I did boil the white eggs but we never got around to dyeing it. It just got too late too fast. We didn't watch the movie. We did not do bath time because Born snuck in the bathroom and went in the shower right before I was about to put them in the bath and then it, the night just got away from us and it got too late, which is the thing I always struggle with. There's just so much to do and the night flies by and a lot of times I can't finish everything that I want to do. Same goes for the cleaning. River is like a tornado. Um, and being home the whole day like we were today she just she trashed the playroom the kitchen was a huge mess because she I just can't clean when they're awake 
Um, I did fill up the dishwasher and start running it while she was eating dinner and Reed was in the high chair so that was a good head start for me. The bottles are in there so I just have to fill those up for tonight. Um, and the bedroom's a mess. She spilled her new hair ties all over the place. She opened that up of course. So those are all over the floor. Um, I didn't get to put any laundry away, so I have a big load of clean laundry sitting in the crib right now. Um, and yeah, there's just so much stuff that I can never get to. It's really hard. I definitely do not feel ahead of things today. Sometimes I feel like I'm on top of things and caught up. Today is not one of those days I don't feel caught up at all so I'm ending the weekend and starting the new week off feeling like I'm already kind of behind it. Now what I have to do is finish her lunch, prep Reed's bottles, um, I have to pack their extra clothes and diapers for tomorrow, I have to pack um, formula for Reed, I think that's all the packing I have to do and the snacks. And then um, I have to just prep all of our clothes for the morning. And that's probably all I'm gonna be able to do tonight even though I really want to do some cleaning up. I just can't stay up super late because of work in the morning. I'm really hungry. I probably won't even have the energy to make myself anything to eat. I'm probably just gonna skip eating. I can smell the fries cooking, so I know Eric and Bourne are out there making their burgers now. Um, and that's it. I am going to clean up the hair ties that she spilled all over the floor because there's no way that I can handle that being there in the morning. And that is it for this weekend, so good night.